happen with this. This is your notification center right here. So search game center. Game center is right here. Oops, I hit chess. Sorry. Game center. Quit chess. Never play chess on a Mac. Never play chess on a computer in general. Right, so this is game center right here. Let me sign in. So this is the first um developer preview. There should be another one. Now this is game center on my Mac right now. Um so it's not been used in game center. Continue. Alright, yes, next. Yes, that's not my birthday. Uh just agree. I just want to get this done with. Um, so I don't know if you will be able to oh shoot. I gotta choose a nickname. Be Jack and Tosh. Jack and Tosh. Then done. Okay, so let's see games. I don't have any friends. I don't download download them from the app store. So right now there's probably not gonna be anything right now because um it's still a developer preview but you when you're gonna download them it's gonna be from it's gonna be from the app store um, so that's this is game center on a mac on the mac yeah add friends so i can request me no friends of course um so game center closed now we're going to look at Launchpad is back. Everything of line was originally. They got rid of the expose button, put the dashboard button back in. Don't know why, but I never really used dashboard. It's just really one of those things. Calendars. Um, so it should have all my stuff on the calendars, but I don't like sorting it like this. I like it going by the month. And then, um, yeah, so should like put everything on it. This is December, November. Yeah, this is no school. Modern Warfare 3 came out that day, so yeah, I had yeah, what else is here? No school, iPhone 4S is released. So, yeah, it, syn it synced everything because I had it on my iP iPod in the beginning, so yeah. Um, I have to quit calendar. So, now I'll show you reminders. Show notes and messages too. We'll open everything up. Put reminders first. Okay, so doesn't look like you can get full screen with this, but you can with messages, as you can see. But so I don't have. I have five completed. I have school stuff here. Yeah. So it works. I'll create one right now. I'll just put a video. Click it. Click the little I button and. This is really nice. I like that a lot. And remind me on day. And the day will be what's today's date? Today is the nineteenth. Uh, um, what time? Uh, nine twenty two. Twenty no twenty two. Okay. So I have my iPod here right now. I should go off. Oh, have hit done. Okay, so should go off, and it did, and it went off on my Mac, right here, and it also went off on my iPod. So yeah, it's pretty cool. So I can just hit what snooze. Snooze, I think, just delays it like a camera. So newest. That's just really cool. I like that a lot. I'll use that a lot too. As if I have my iPod downstairs, my iPhone downstairs, and then uh, my I have a reminder, and uh, I I don't have my phone or my iPod with me. It will go off on my Mac. So I have messages here. I don't really use messages on my iPod because I don't know a lot of my friends that have like most of my friends. They don't really use use it. I'll just text them if I want to say something to them. So, write a new message to. So, right when you open it, it's who it's going to be to. Buddies, I don't have any buddies. <laughs> so, yeah. 
That's messages, really. Quick and see. So, this is a message. I did this uh, the day it was released. It was February 19th. Wait, no. This is today. I didn't do that today, though. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, open up notes on my iPod. And I also have notes running on my Mac. Um, on uh, Mountain Line. And uh, you should see, um, as you can see, you see this note here and the same note here. So, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new note. Um, let's see here. Just type some random stuff. Okay, and then hit done. Now we're going to go back to my Mac. Click it. Go back to notes. And it should pop up any second now. As you can see, it's uh, loading. It's still loading, but uh, still did not pop up on my Mac. I don't know why it says this. I made this yesterday because I just made that. Oh, no, I made that yesterday. So. Yeah, so there it is right here. Just double clicked it and it loaded. So I'll show you that again because it didn't work very well. All right, done. Trusty. All right, then double click. Double click it. Yeah, as you can see, it still has a little delay. It's not instantaneously, but like I, it, but still, you get the idea. It's just a beta right now, so uh, yeah. All right, so that's um, yep, here it is, trusty. <laughs> so that's notes. As you can see, they're really trying to um include iOS into a Mac without really changing the whole operating system. Um, this, these are really the basic features. Nothing has really changed except for notification center, reminders, messages, notes, um, game center. Um, so finder, the new the finder window is all the same. Um, so Launchpad is still the same. You should, you're probably most likely going to have your gestures. I don't know why they would get rid of that, but uh, I can't use them on my Mac because uh, it won't, it, uh, it, it uses it for the line instead of the uh, virtual machine, which is mountain line. So, yeah. Um, Game Center looks pretty cool. I'm going to try to download a game that I uh, have and see if I actually get any uh, achievements or scores and stuff. So overall, I think it's very, it's pretty nice. Um, it's a pretty good upgrade. So um, I would probably, I'm pr pro most likely going to upgrade it because as you can see, Things, simple things like reminders and notes and message, like these really two things, the notification center, they're just, it makes things so much easier because now it's, you have an iPhone on your Mac and it, you have like two devices and one basically now. So it's pretty helpful, I have to say. Um, so that's really it, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, this is Jackintosh7 here, and uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe. See you later.